Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a double review and comparison. There are actually two of the same items but different color or details you could say. So it's two Bottega Veneta items for men and I really like this brand because they don't splash their logos as boldly as the other ones. I think some of the logos and monogram can be nicely done but I appreciate Bottega Veneta's quality and craftsmanship and their design details. So there's two boxes. These are how the two items came in. And they're actually from different seasons. So I'll start with this one first. It comes in a box. The receipts, depending on where you get them, they just come in a, a folder like this very simple and then the receipt from this store was just a regular those thermal sensitive paper what they call the card case also a coin wallet or coin purse but for the men's I think they switched the naming to the card case this is in the intrachato it has it in the flap only and then the rest of it is just smooth this is calfskin so that's the side, it's, it's gusseted. This one I've actually used for, I think about three to four years. I got this from the San Francisco store. So it has one button here that just opens up. And right now I just actually stuffed it with a couple of cologne samples from Tom Ford. But because this is soft leather, it kind of collapses on itself if you don't have things inside. Um, so it's fully lined in leather, which is nice. So this brown part is also leather. And this is made in Italy. And it comes with, their leather goods come with this kind of a control tag. So it has a quality control number in the back. I might tell you when and where it's made, but I'm not sure how to read them. So it comes with one large compartment here. It's 4.3 inches, I believe, across, and about one inch depth. And then in the front is another pocket, and it's completely lined in leather as well. And then in the back, you also have one compartment. So I use this as a wallet typically in the fall because it it's, gets a little bulkier. I don't put it in my pant pockets, I put it in my jacket pockets. So I store all my kind of uh, bills and coins here and then I have a couple of cards here and I usually store my most used card in the back which is usually my uh, credit card. So that's this one. Right now it retails for 320 USD. I don't think the pricing has changed that much. So I'm just gonna put this aside. So same box, these, I think they did come with dust bags, but I don't know where I put them because I sometimes use it for other things to store. So just same receipt holder. Sometimes they have these tags inside them. Um, just telling you where it's made in. It's another card case, but this specific one with the, the tricolor, they call the club case. And it's actually a different leather, and it's quite a bit more expensive. This is lambskin. Um, they have specific names for the colors, but I forget what they, what they are, but this one's it's like an anthracite, I think, and then the red, like a terracotta red color, and then a neutral, almost caramel color. And you can see the graining on this is different. I'll show a side by side after. This one I've not used yet. This one I think was from two or three seasons ago. They don't, I don't think they repeat the colors, but obviously they repeat the style and the inside's the same. They changed the color of the button. This one's a little bit more bronzy, but it's the same, same exact interior. Uh, 
And like I said, this one's lambskin and it retails right now this style for $400. But again, the color right now they have the more marine color. It's like a dark, it's like a blue and then a cyan, I think, and then a lighter blue. So here they are side by side. You can definitely see the difference in the type of leather. I mean, I, granted I did use this for a couple of years, but still, you can see the difference in kind of the, the green and the detail. And this one obviously has different colors. So that's definitely, you can definitely see there. This one I forgot to mention, the camera is kind of hard to pick up, but it's a very, very dark navy called tourmaline. And right now they don't have this in this color. It's somewhat seasonal. I think they probably would bring it back, but it's not every season that they release it in this color. I think if I remember correctly, the sales associate, when I picked this up in San Francisco, she said it was, it was gonna be limited to that season, but I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, it's a really nice um, alternate style of wallet if you need to put some stuff in here besides bill. It's a, it's a great compartment for it. It it's, fits in your hand nicely. And if you, if you do actually want to use it as a wallet, you can kind of flatten it out like this and use that so, but it can expand to fill more things. Um, this one is $400. Again, I don't think they changed the price since I bought this. And this is $320 because of the different type of leather. And this one has three, technically three different colors. So that's it. If you have any questions, please uh, comment, let me know. And please subscribe if you like more of these videos. Thank you again for watching. Have a great day.